a monochromatic light shines on a 400 line per millimeter grating. The first order line on the screen is 20 centimeters from the zeroth order line. If the screen is 0.8 meters away from the grating, A. What is the wavelength of the light? B. How far from the center of the screen is the second order line? The grating has 400 lines per millimeter. That means the distance D between adjacent lines would be 1 millimeter divided by 400. So the distance between the lines would be 0 0.0025 millimeters. The first order line, M equals to 1, is 20 centimeters from the zeroth order line, so it's 20 centimeters from the center of the screen. So y is 0.2 meters, 20 centimeters. The distance on the screen is the y. If the screen is 0.8 meters away, that means 0.8 meters is the l, the distance to the screen. And we are looking for the wavelength. So we can use d sine theta equals to m lambda. The d is 0 0.0025 milli is 10 to the negative third. And then times the sine theta. Now, if the angle is small, or if y is much, much smaller than l, we can use y over l to replace the sine theta. But now the y is not much, much smaller than l. Therefore, I have to use tan theta equals to y over l. So tan theta equals to y over l. That means the angle theta is inverse 10.2 over 0.8. And this will give us an angle that is 14 degrees. So I, have, I, I can use 14 degrees over here. That's sine 14 degrees equals to m equals to 1 times the wavelength. So solving this equation will give us lambda that is 6.05 times 10 to the negative 7th meters. So this is some sort of orange light. And then part B, we want the second order. So m equals to 2. And that means uh, d sine theta equals to m lambda. The d will still be 0 0.0025 milli times the sine theta. Now, because the second order, the angle is going to be even bigger, that means uh, we cannot use the sine theta equals y over l. So we have to first find the angle and then use tan theta equals to y over l. So this is times uh, sine theta equals to m times the wavelength 6.05 times 10 to the negative 7th. So this gives us uh, sine theta that is uh, 0.484. That means uh, theta is inverse sine 0.484 and that gives us 28.9 degrees. So now we can do the tan theta equals to y over l. So tan 28.9 degrees would equal to y divided by l which is 0.8. So this gives us y equals to 0.43 meters. And that's the second order. Notice that the first order is 20 centimeters away and the second order is 0.43 meters away. So this is more than twice the 20 because the angle is big.